The other thing I just want to add about the video for this is we did have scenes from the our beloved Columbia Hotel in London. Yeah, the which, pub is, there, which, which is where all the bands would, would stay. Yeah. Didn't we say that one time in Metallica and Slade and The Alarm and Prefab Sprout, all these bands yeah. were warming around yeah. And it's still there. It is still there, yeah. I popped in there a couple years ago and it looked virtually the same. The pub was still there, that, that common room where we all hung out. Oh, Jimmy? This song isn't on the album, is it? On the album version, is it? The live album? Yeah. Oh, it's a bonus for the viewers. Oh, oh okay. I guess. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't remember this one. Now, this is uh, Green Thoughts, a song that uh, I took a great li deal of liberty with because green really represents envy. But I don't know that there's a color that represents jealousy. Uh, red, perhaps, mm. but it's really about jealousy and suspicion in terms of a relationship. And uh, I believe the title was taken from a book by an author named John O'Hara. Um, and I would, I would, I'm still a collector. And uh, there's a book that I came across in the old days when there were still thrift shops before eBay, and it was called Green Thoughts by John O'Hara. Yeah, I think I since found that book, a copy of it somewhere. Well, mine was a. A GI version. It was an early form of a paperback book, and it opened up differently. Armed Forces version ah, huh. of it, and that's where you get your ideas from. You know, the title sort of wrote the lyrics. Well, then you tricked me because I almost could remember you showing me a book about gardening that was called Green Thoughts. No, maybe that was after the fact. <laughs> I, I think you found so. a book at a thrift shop that was about gardening, and it said Green Thoughts on it. <laughs> But this, I believe, uh, as a recording, was just the perfect closer to that album. Right? Absolutely. You know, as recorded at the Capitol Tower in December of 1987. That's true. What a kick it was to be able to hang out at that building and uh, work in Studio B. Merle Haggard recorded all his stuff, and I'm sure the four freshmen were in there quite a bit. The early Beach Boys, the first couple albums might have been cut in that room. We had, we had the run of the building. We were hanging out on the roof in the echo chamber. and This is the fabled Capitol Tower. Capitol Tower, Hollywood, California. <laughs>